It is such a pleasure to welcome you to this training session titled Using Science Direct Effectively. I am Ayoriwa Aregbeshola. What is Science Direct all about? Science Direct is the world's leading source for scientific, technical, and medical research. It covers over 24 disciplines, including agricultural sciences, engineering, biological sciences, social sciences, and humanities. Science Direct contains full text articles from journals and books primarily published by SCBL. These are journals managed by renowned editors, articles written by respected authors, and read by researchers from around the globe. Science Direct publishes over a quarter of the world's full text scholarly articles. It hosts over 18 million pieces of content from more than 2,500 journals and 39,000 electronic books. It contains over 16 million articles, including articles in press which offer rapid access to recently accepted manuscripts. Over 25 million researchers a month count on Science Direct. The good thing here is that access to Science Direct is provided by Landmark University Library to members of faculty, staff, and students. There is IP-enabled access while using Science Direct. This means that whenever an individual is connected to Landmark University Network, such individual does not require any login details to have access to the full text article in Science Direct. No limits on number of simultaneous users and number of downloads. There are two full text format in Science Direct. They are HTML and PDF. There is easy retrieval of articles in Science Direct. Science Direct is flexible is, and there is dynamic reference links. Let us get started on Science Direct and discover the publications you need. Science Direct is accessible on www.sciencedirect.com. As you can see, access is brought to you by Landmark University. No login details is required to access full text article in Science Direct whenever an individual is connected with Landmark University network. In the case an individual is not connected to Landmark University network as a faculty staff or student of Landmark University, such individual can scroll on any down on any Science Direct page and click uh, the remote access link. All emails ending with lmu.edu.ng are eligible for this remote access. If you click this remote access link, follow the prompt all through until you have access to uh, remote access to the full text articles in Science Direct. Landmark University Library only subscribe to journal uh, articles on Science Direct. For books, we have another platform, Progress eBook Central, that handles uh, eBook um, eBooks for our readers. Landmark University only subscribe to full text articles, journal articles on Science Direct. Let's continue. This is the home page of Science Direct. As you can see, like I said, the access is brought to you by Landmark University. That means that as an individual, you have access to the open uh, to materials that has open access content and also materials that require subscriptions to have access to its full content. We have several fields here. We can search based on keywords, author's name, the um, journal titles, volume, and all that. 
take for instance i'm interested in robotics you know, if you click uh, the search icon the system takes you to uh, retrieve all material that relate to robotics remember i said landmark university only subscribe to book only to like subscribe to journal articles on science directs from this result 236,953 results were retrieved based on that search term robotics but because landmark university library subscribe to books i'm going to limit my search on, only to journal articles so i'm going to check this that is i'm interested in review articles know fully where the landmark will subscribe to journal articles on science direct then anything articles i'm going to tick them then i'm sure it has reduced the search result now to 152596 results if you browse browse through and um, of course going by the result is still large so depending on your needs you can feel that you are only interested in 2021 and 2020 articles only on robotics now it has reduced the search to 19,881 you can see feel that it's not just general robotics i'm only interested in neuro computing aspect of robotics then it has reduced it to 543 results so you may decide now to browse through and see the one that is of interest to you Take for instance now, if I'm interested in this, I have two uh, options to have access to the full text of this article titled Robots Recognizing Human Intention and Interaction with Humans Based on a Multitask Model Combining STGCN LSTM Model and YOHO Model. Now, if I'm interested in this article, I can decide to click on this then i download the full pdf of this article i can also decide to click on this then I have access to the uh, full text of this article in html format now this is the full this is the pdf um, uh, format of the full text article that I just downloaded. So you can browse through and uh, see the one that is of interest to you and probably download it and save. You can, uh, if you are interested in the HTML, this is the HTML format. The advantage of the HTML format is that it makes browsing easier and you can also follow the hyperlinks. Now I can start to go straight to the references. And from the references, there is a dynamic reference links, just like at the introduction of this um, training. Now I can decide to follow all these cross references and see the ones that are very related to what I'm interested in. As you can see, I can click all these cross references, all these, all these to even see the ones that has links or connection with what I'm interested in. Let's go up. I can also see from this, um, the top right corner of the screen, I can see I can also um, browse through recommended articles. That is article that are very related to these original article that I uh, opened. So as you can see, the future genera generator of ad negative um, maybe sample prediction interval estimation of solar then learning allocentric uh, representations and so these are articles that has um, connection or that are related to these original intended and open articles you can uh, um, the left hand side of the screen has various subsection of this of article. It makes um, uh, browsing and um, reading easy, very fast. Take for instance, I want to click on 
experiments in you within a click i'm already there. there's no need of scrolling down to get to a particular subsection of the article and um, if this article is not of interest to you or you want other articles an individual can still come here to reframe his or her search take for instance now maybe i'm not even interested in robotics again maybe i'm i'm now interested in um, maybe artificial intelligence artificial Maybe I'm now interested in artificial intelligence. Now I can still continue to, I can check the left hand side of the screen and see the ones that are of interest to me. I'm sorry, artificial spelling is not covered. Artificial intelligence. So I have um, over 162,000 um, results based on that keyword. Like I said, Landmark University only subscribe to um, journal articles, so I will check the articles there only, and also consider years of publication. I may decide to look at what is being done. Um, what has been done since 2017. So that means that from 2017, 2018, 2019, 2020, 2021 are the articles I'm interested in based on the keyword artificial intelligence. And um, it has reduced my search result to 41,643. Reducing the search result is not the main aim. Your aim, your aim as a user of this platform is to get the articles that are very uh, that matches your needs so you keep refining your search on the based on the parameter on the left hand side of the screen until uh, that article or that information desired on the platform will be retrieved i'm sure i'm sure you are I'm sure you can uh, maximize the use of this platform now. Next time on this channel, we shall be looking at Mendeley as a reference manager, as an academic um, network platform, and as a platform for funding opportunities. Looking forward to continue to support you throughout all the information topics and more on this channel. Thank you for watching and God bless you.